Hey everybody, Van Jr. here, Lost and Found Metal Detecting, and Tara's getting ready to do her next coin roll hunt. As you can see laid out in front of her, she's got $10 in pennies and $10 in nickels. <laughs> As she's showing them off and she's excited to get started. So we'll get back to you with our first find. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, we're back again, and so far not a whole lot to be noted. Uh, Tara did find a couple... Uh, Canadian pennies, a 75 and a 98, but she just pulled a really cool find, and we'll get in close on this. She just found a 1909 VDB. Boy, she was sure hoping there was an S mint mark on it, but no such luck. But it is a VDB, and we'll get some close-ups of that later on with the camera, so that that way you can see it. But yeah, very cool find. She's quite happy. 1909, it's her oldest coin, uh, coin roll hunting so far. Stay tuned everybody, we'll get back to you with the next one. Found another wheat penny, 1942 plane. My second one. There we are. So that's the second wheat penny in about, what are we, what are you into, about six rolls into it? About that. Alright, stay tuned folks, we'll get back to you. I found my third wheat penny, 1958D. That one's in pretty nice shape. Stay tuned, everybody. We'll get back to you the next one. Got my fourth wheat penny, a 1949. Another nice one, Tara. Turn it over. There's the back side. All right, stay tuned, folks. All right, folks, and here's the wrap-up for the pennies. So Tara's best find so far, she got this 1909 VDB. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, did you hear in the background? She just went, woohoo. <laughs> she got a 1942, a 1949, and a 1958 wheat penny. And she did get four 1959s, but no 1960s. Otherwise, she covered the board all the way to 2014. And on to the special finds. She got a really nice shape, 1964 here. Six Canadian pennies, a 56, a 66, a 75, an 82, an 84, and a 98. Um, then she got these two that are somewhat off-struck. A 76. You see it's a real narrow rim on one side. And a 91, and the same thing there. It's wide rimmed on, on the right side and narrow on the left. And then, of course, the crusties. Nine of those. And all the piles of new ones. So stay tuned, folks. We'll clear the board, and she'll get ready to do her $10 in nickels. Coming up right next. Stay tuned. All right, on to the wrap-up for the nickels. Um, pretty much covered the board again. She did get one 1941, a 1959, no 60s or 61s, 62, 63, 64, no 65s, no 67s or 68s, missing the 85s, the 2003s, and the 2009. So nothing too exciting here, except for the 41 being the oldest one. Just missed the war nickel by a year. But stay tuned. She'll get back to you with her next hunt. Thanks for watching. Good luck and happy hunting.